How did Roman rule alter the course of Egypt's history? What indelible marks did it leave on the landscape, culture and people of this ancient land? To understand this, we must journey back in time to the conquest of Egypt by Rome, a turning point that reshaped Egypt's destiny. In the wake of centuries of Persian and Greek rule, the Roman annexation of Egypt, following the defeat of Cleopatra and Mark Antony by Octavian at Actium in 31 BC, marked a major geopolitical shift. It was the end of the Hellenistic period and the dawn of Roman rule. Egypt under Roman rule was unique. It was directly controlled by the emperor, not the Roman Senate, and the prefect appointed was often a trusted equestrian, not a senator, to minimize the risk of usurpation. This unique governance structure underlined Egypt's importance to Rome. Egypt's economic significance to Rome was undeniable. It was the breadbasket of the Roman Empire, providing grain, papyrus, and other resources. The annual Nile flood ensured reliable grain harvests, critical for feeding Rome's populace. Alexandria, the jewel of Egypt, was the second most important city in the Roman Empire. A hub of commerce, learning, and culture, it was home to a significant Jewish community. The Roman period witnessed a blend of Egyptian, Greek, and Roman cultures, evident in art, architecture, and religious practices. Temples to traditional Egyptian deities were built even as Roman architectural styles were introduced. Rome and Egypt was a stratified society. The Greek-speaking elite were at the top, followed by the native Egyptians. Roman citizens in Egypt enjoyed privileges, including legal rights and lower taxes. Life varied greatly between urban centers like Alexandria and rural agricultural areas. Agriculture, particularly grain production, was the economy's backbone. Despite Roman rule, traditional Egyptian religious practices continued, often syncretized with Hellenistic and Roman deities. However, from the first century AD, Christianity began spreading in Egypt, becoming a significant religion by the third century. This led to tensions with traditional religions and Roman pagan practices. Egypt was also a birthplace of Christian monasticism, playing a crucial role in the development of the Christian church. The third century saw the Roman Empire facing severe internal and external challenges. In Egypt, these led to economic difficulties, rebellions, and periods of instability. Diocletian's reforms aimed to stabilize the empire and included dividing Egypt into smaller administrative units to improve governance. Religious conflicts escalated as the spread of Christianity led to tensions and sometimes violent conflicts, particularly as the Roman state tried to impose religious conformity in the later periods. By the late 4th century, the Roman Empire was divided and Egypt became part of the Eastern Roman Byzantine Empire. The swift Arab-Muslim conquest in 642 AD ended Byzantine rule and began a new era in Egyptian history. Roman Egypt's legacy is profound, influencing the religious rise of Coptic Christianity, cultural and social landscape of Egypt. The period also left an archaeological treasure trove, providing insights into ancient urban and rural life. This period is a testament to the dynamic nature of Egypt's history, reflecting a remarkable blend of ancient traditions and new influences, shaping the region as we know it today. Thank you for watching and subscribe for more.